Hey guys, and welcome to my next reaction to Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I... This is gonna be the one of the last ones that's gonna be kind of late, as I told you um, for the beginning of this season, that I just had a lot going on on the weekends and breaks and th all of that stuff. Um, so I haven't really been getting these out to you very promptly. Hopefully that will be kind of fixed as as <laughs> the time uh, as as this season goes on and everything like that. So yeah, I hope that you guys are excited for my reaction. Let's get started. Oh no! No! Oh no! What are you doing? I like watching you sleep. <sighs> oh, this is gonna make me sad, isn't it? Yo, yo. Just take a minute. You lost to someone that's never easy. I'm getting used to losing people. Yo, yo. I didn't have a choice. I feel like I'm losing control. You used to be the one I turned to. I take your orders without question. You need more from me? Oof. That is tough. You might want to keep an eye on him. Director. Oof. Ice cold. Ice there cold. Is no hope. Decommissioned. Oh my god, Enoch. Hunted. I have become a cautionary tale used to steer children away from a life of crime and excess. Yeah. <laughs> um, that, that can't be good. What's happening? Is everyone okay? Oh dear. Oh yeah! Oh dear. <laughs> Same. You keep staring like that, my head's bound to catch fire. I'm by me. I once acted like they know me. No. No. Hello. Enoch. It has been a long time. You look the same. As do you. Enoch, you are to be judged for tampering with the universe. Then I will face my punishment. Oh no, Enoch! Yeah, and my buddy here is nursing a wicked hangover. I mean, can we at least get some water or something? He gets cranky! <sighs> I love these two. It was being nice. You're a whiny bitch. I don't understand. We thought this was a Confederacy ship. It was. But now it's not. Well, well. Our home world has been destroyed. All that remains of the Chronicom race are aboard this fleet. Entire worlds were seriously destroyed. We never imagined it would happen to ours. And then it was too late. The effects spread rapidly, consuming our planet. These distortions, what caused them? Unknown. Atara wants to know how you were able to travel through time so that we may go back and save our world. But I was prepared. Uh oh. Bestie. Ah! Ah! Gemma! Oh! Stop this! Hurt fits one more time and I will tear the ship apart. If any harm comes to me, those ships will scatter across the galaxy. Behave. Oh. Or you will never find him. Okay. Lord! Oh. It's the other thing. Okay. I didn't kill him, but I am going to kill you. Woo! And I'm gonna make sure it hurts. Every dream is someone else's nightmare. Look, you're the imposter. I know how he lived and died. Everything. Is who the hell are you? Mm-hmm. Sag, 
Did you, uh... I can't the take book? these. Because that's such a cheesy way to ask a girl for a date. Like I said, I plan to say it, but as you know, I never did. Did you mind? No, it's the other thing. I don't want to see this. What is this? Initiation. You're gonna kill him. Like hell I am. You're gonna do great. No one's gonna hurt you. I'm gonna be <laughs> recently become best friends. Ah! I cannot believe I ever granted you access to my data port. Oh. You refuse to assist me? Then I will proceed my way. That's a, it's not a good Your way. way. No, it's gonna be a bad way. If anyone can solve the mysteries of time <gasps> travel, it is Leopold Fish. Fish! What would motivate him to do what we need? No. 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 Her. No! Put Gemma Simmons in danger and Fitz can solve anything. I need Fitz alive, which means they won't kill him. I can kick her ass. <laughs> Let's go. Go, 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 go. Enoch! Being right doesn't stop it from feeling wrong. Sweetie. Car crash. Husband. Brain dead. Machines breathing for him. I had him turn off the ventilator. They never will forgive me. But I took comfort in knowing it was the right one. And so should you. Oh. You're not creating these things, you're trying to stop them. We follow them to a new world, then track anything that doesn't belong there and kill it. That's why you came after Deke. What is it? Exhaust. <laughs> Nothing good has come from these things. But ley lines are believed to be a matrix of planetary energy. We've seen what these birds do with human energy. The result would be catastrophic. Uh-huh. Serving only their creator. Creator? A person? A monster. This is the closest I've come to stopping it. But for me, the tick of the clock is only getting louder. Every dream is someone else's nightmare. Wait. What did you say? When their creator arrives, I'm gonna burn it all down. Oh. No, don't shoot! Daisy, don't! Simmons, get out of the way. Enoch was right. Fitz can't solve time travel without me. Let the others leave and I'll go with you. No, 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 don't do this. We will find another way. But there isn't one. You followed me for a year across the galaxy. Oh, no! I never would have made it here without you. No, Simmons, I... I can't leave you. <laughs> you have to. Oh, that got me really emotional. <laughs> because I'm so mysterious. I was gonna go with nuts. He even said you're unhinged. Whatever you say, Princess Butterfly. Ah! You'll be reborn, and then you see. Oh, thank God. Damn it, Oh, ow! I thought you were coming around.
thing made me really sad but it's just he was trying to find the best way to save Fitz and even though that's not what Fitz wants it's just uh, he would it was, it was, it was, oh, my heart my heart um uh, okay that's uh, oh my god um at least Simmons and Fitz are together at least we have that going for us right because I was really not about to have a, more episodes without um, Fitz and Simmons together and, and all of that stuff. So I'm, I'm very, very happy um, that they are at least in the same vicinity, even if Fitz is not. Um, this whole thing, everything that's going on with Sarge and everything like that is going to be very interesting. For Daisy to try to comprehend or deal with and everything like that. I feel like that's going to be very interesting. Um, I would love to see a Daisy and May reunion. Um, I would also like to see a Daisy and Deke reunion. <laughs> Might be awkward, but you know, whatever. Um, I, 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 so I have a very, very deep love for, for May and Coulson's relationship. I always have. Um, it's so funny because I feel like, I feel like I've grown a lot since starting to watch the show. Now I watched, I was not somebody who caught up or anything like that. I watched season one, episode one as it aired, um, because I'm just such a giant fan of, of Joss Whedon that whatever he does, um, and I know that it's Jed Weed, but in the beginning there was a lot of hype with Joss Whedon being involved and everything like that. And so, you know what? I was on board. I was like, okay. And do, why I'm saying that is I feel like that was ugh, such a long time ago, at least, or I've just been through so much in my life and everything like that, that May in particular, but May and Colson their relationship was always something that I that I cared for but as I feel like I went through shit in life I more and more appreciated their relationship it wasn't they didn't have to do big displays of affection for each other um, besides the she, sorry there's a fly and it's driving me absolutely insane um, besides the big <laughs> shield kiss which was the best but it was more about everything that they've been through together and their relationship in particular is just very significant to me and I, uh, I, I like him and just these flashbacks were just devastating me every single time to see that you know obviously it's wonderful that they got time together and everything like that um, and I still think that there is a bit of mystery around Sarge. I'm not entirely surprised that Sarge is trying to do something and his team is trying to do something um, relatively good. Like, I, you know, that doesn't entirely surprise me. Um, the, the butterfly girl, I just... 
when she's unconscious, I like her a lot better. I, that's all I'll say about that. But, um, but I, I, I find the dynamic really interesting between May and, and Sarge in particular. And I feel like that's just going to keep growing. It's going to be really interesting to see where, where all of that goes. I, uh, do, like, I really loved, um, this episode, even though it was getting me emotional at parts and everything like that. I, I really enjoyed it. Um, loving this season so far. Um, yeah. So, uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.